think we're live. Let me check my audio. Refresh. What up, what up, everyone? We'll get started here soon. Um, I'm sure the comments, maybe at least a couple of them might come in regarding my hair. Uh, I was trying to give myself a haircut earlier, and I screwed up. And then when I went to switch guards to, like, you know, a lower setting or a lower guard, I saw a three on it. Turns out it was a one. I shaved my head when I was trying to clean up what I had done, made it way worse, and made actual, like, bald spots. <laughs> so... So yeah, um, I'm pretty freshly shaved all over, shaved too close on the side, had to even it out, mess that up. Not a very good day for me and razors and clippers, I'll say that. Uh, they won the battle today. So um, I saw three on it. Oh, Turned here we go. One. I shaved my head. All right. I don't know how much of that opening uh, was in there. Maybe we'll wait for a couple people to come in. Let me make sure my commands work. I updated Moobot. So there are some commands. So uh, if you type in exclamation point brains, you'll get a link to uh, where you can donate to brain aneurysm research if you'd like to do that. Uh, uh, exclamation point commands, that obviously brings up the command list. There's 11 commands total. We have, if you type in DC, uh, that will bring up the death count. I don't think I reset it, so we're probably not gonna use that tonight. Um, if you hit donate, that'll donate to the channel. That'll give you a link to where you can donate to the channel. Uh, if you hit Echo, that'll just say good boy to my dog Echo. Uh, music, it'll give you links to OK Cunning's music and Santa Jaws's music, who have both, you know, helped me out on a lot of things on the stream before. Um, and I think that's Kitty Bunny. She's like a bright yellow, so of course I can't read her font. Um, awesome. What's up, Kitty Bunny? How's it going? <laughs> uh, and let's see what else we got here. Um, Donate, uh, Echo, Music, Parasites. If you hit Parasites, I did cut my hair. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm going to explain that one second. Because I already did, but I don't think the, the stream was recording yet. Uh, so if there, if you hit Parasites, it brings up a lot of people that I was looking through that have donated in the past. I think there's more people to add here. This is just what I was able to squeeze in before the stream started. So I'll be updating this at some point soon. Um, and then if you hit Tweet, that'll let you tweet out a link to people to come here so you can share uh, what's up, Lonely Symbiote? How's it going? Hey, Kitty, she says. Um, if you hit uh, Command Seek, that'll uh, give you my information, uh, like my YouTube channels. If you hit Command Venom, that'll give you my uh, social media uh, um, links. And then also uptime, so you know how long we've been playing, which right now is just under three minutes. Um, so yeah, my hair. So uh, earlier, <laughs> I uh, I was like, all right, I, I was resting. I, I slept a lot last night, but I still felt like I needed a little bit more sleep. So around two in the afternoon, I started laying down. And then uh, I think I took like a 20 or 30 minute nap. And then I got up and was like, all right, let me cut my hair. I've been planning on doing this for a while. My hair was getting really long and spiky and stuff. And I have to put product in it. And I hate putting product in it because it just to hold it up. Because at the end of the night, it's hard to wash out. Um, so I said, all right, uh, let me just go in and just take like a three guard or a four guard and just buzz cut my hair and then maybe do my mohawk thing or something and so I started doing it and I realized I was way too tired to do it I started screwing up and then when I was like all right let's even it out where's the three guard I went to look for the three guard I saw a three picked it up started shaving noticed that it was literally making bald spots in my head uh, because for some reason the one guard also has a three on it uh, and I guess all the guards had like two numbers on them which is Normally wouldn't confuse me because normally I would, you know, pay attention enough, but I just looked at the first number I saw, thought it was a three, and just started going. And when I realized I did that, I was like, oh, crap. And then I started shaving my face and, uh, again, screwed up and tried to, like, even it out on both sides and screwed it up. So then I had to just shave it all the way down. <laughs> so now I have, like, this little stupid goatee patch um, and a, a shaved head to a one guard. Um, luckily, you know... And I'm going to take advantage of this while I still have hair, you know, because I'm sure in like five or six years, I probably will start losing it. Um, but luckily, my hair grows fast. So, you know, hopefully in the next like couple weeks, it'll get to kind of the length I wanted to get it at today. But yeah, I totally screwed up. <laughs> yeah, I, I had a really bad day. Like I said in the intro, my clippers and my uh, razor, uh, they won the battle today. Normally, they listen to me and we, we, we groom ourselves fairly well. But uh, no, not today. Day one. So now I just look like a fat little kid <laughs> with a goatee. Um, yeah, I'm not really a big fan of, you know, how I look in general. Not that I really put a lot of thought into how I look, because if I did, I would, you know, try to 
change that, but you know, I uh, I really don't like with close hair and, and clean shaved face. I really don't like uh, how I look there. But um, but hey, whatever, you know, it'll all grow back. Don't worry, seek your still cute on. <laughs> Thanks. Don't encourage me. Um, I'm good, just getting ready for bed uh, because I'm going back to work early tomorrow. Hey, good luck going back to work. Send our love to Elijah. If you end up going to bed or falling asleep soon, no worries. I appreciate you being in here. Um, this puzzle we can't solve yet. And let me check our map. I want to make sure we're going still the right way. Yeah, because we couldn't, we couldn't navigate over there just yet. So, uh, so yeah, we're doing good. We're doing well. Superman does good. We're doing well. Oh. Wait a minute, what? I can go to the watch house on the other side. Oh, that. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> let's, all right, let's check it out. I don't know if that's like a boss area or if we're supposed to go upstairs first but hey we're going here first um you still look like a cuddle bear you're fine <laughs> oh thanks i'm glad you're a good kitty lonely says i hope you get some rest yes rest up uh he will be at 5 a.m huh so i'm gonna pass that now but i'm gonna watch on xbox still okay well thank you i can't turn back now oh that's not good Good thing we saved. We'll, we'll, we'll create a separate save in case we have to backtrack. That's funny. We're in a boathouse. Isn't like Resident Evil 7 kind of goes into a boathouse? I've said this before many times, but one of the things I like about Capcom, and sometimes I, I don't, is that, that they will... Um, oh! Is that they will recycle. They will recycle ideas and, and locations and stuff like that. Not that this is that. Not that that means seven, you know, took from this. Not at all. I'm just saying, like, uh, oh, we fought these things when we went to that hell pit. Oh. It's quiet. Too quiet. Thank you all for being here with me tonight. I think I messed up my kneecap. Kitty says no. Whoa. Well, I'm going to mess this creature up. Um, I hope your kneecap is fine. I'm, I'm sorry it hurts. Oh, you want some of this? Oh, wow. Her weapon does not do a lot of damage to these guys. Here we go. And she can't, like, drain their souls and heal herself. Oh, wait, but she can go through the lock. Yep. All right, so we can finally venture through. Whoa, what up? Ow. Oh, we got we to gotta heal right up. Boom. Nope. I try to guard before. Oh, come on. All right, sweet. Uh, thank you, Mubot. It's nice to have Mubot back. Uh, so Mubot, so last stream we played, I think I, I was like, oh, put in this command, and it didn't work. And we were kind of confused. Well, apparently I, I haven't used Mubot in like three months, so it, it like disconnected to my account. Um, so, uh, so yeah. So I had to, like, reactivate all that stuff today. Apocalypse 2. Our demon king was born from the chaos of the Earth's creations and dwells in the deepest and darkest place underground. All demons are born of the demon king. The demon king only presents his holy snake-like body when, when and where the ceremony takes place. No one knows what he does otherwise. Demons, remember, no one disobeys the Demon King. The Holy Spirit of the Demon King shall forever set an example to us all. Alright. 
Um, as a Lonely Symbiote will attest to, um, I've actually had a pretty productive day. I, I spent like two nights ago, I was up to like four or five in the morning, and I had to be at work at like eight that morning. I was up till about four or five um, downloading and deleting a bunch of old videos um, on my main YouTube channel. Uh, because I wanted all my, well not all, but most of my game playthroughs, I wanted I wanted on my gaming channel. And uh, it's funny because for those of you who have been watching this channel for a long time, um, you'll remember that last January I wanted, uh, I wanted to stop using that game channel and I wanted everything moved to one channel. Uh, but uh, that experiment I feel like kind of blew up in my face because what I saw was uh, that whenever I post something that isn't either like a like if I if, if I don't post like Venom Vlog or something like Venom Vlog like the Joker show or something like that or something that's kind of news e kind of driven or comic review driven that seems to be the kind of where my show's focus is and where most of the views come from and I was kind of hoping that maybe I would carry some of those people over into the you know watching the game streams but it's a different audience some some of those people who like getting news and info in like you know 10 to 20 minute videos they're not they don't want to watch like you know let's plays and stuff typically i mean there's a there is some crossover like lonely you know she, she watches both but um but for the most part it doesn't so i was like you know i should have just kept my channel separate and uh and so that's what we're doing so uh, i put everything back I'm putting everything back on my um, gaming channel. So many videos. I still need to watch more. Hey, I don't expect you to watch all of them. I appreciate you. I saw that you watched all the ones I, most of the ones I posted today. I think I posted like 22 videos today um, or something like that. It was something really, really ridiculous. Um, Out. Um, I think I posted 12 Mega Man 10 playthrough videos, like, you know, because I chopped that up into 12, like, 10 minute episodes. So I uploaded all those. I think I got my three episodes of Layers of Fear playthrough up, and three episodes of my Friday the 13th up as well. I don't think I have a. I see, I, I'm missing. I'm missing the fourth one. I can't... And normally I was able to solve the other ones without getting the fourth one, but I'm stuck on this one. What can be enhanced with the souls from the gauntlet? The souls of demons. Maybe that's the answer? It, was it really that simple? Well, it can't be because I don't have the square here. I need the square, so it's not that. Hmm. And it doesn't have demons in here either. It has this, which is a... Uh, The word souls or the souls. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'll have to come back to it later. Can she save? Yeah, she can. All right, we'll we'll do um. A separate save for tonight. I think I need to watch eight more, and I'll ca I'll be caught up. I know I don't have to watch. I just want to. <laughs> well, <laughs> thank you. Um, well, I hope you I hope you enjoy uh, when you watch them. All right. So it looks like we have to go around. Oh, so Somonosuke couldn't have gone through this door anyway. You needed the the lock thing that she has. So we've been going the right way this whole time. Oh, 
Archies, yeah. I don't know if I want to fight here. Wow. Dude, you're a D-bag. Thing is, I've already used like one medicine. I feel like I heal with this girl a lot. I'm not very good with her, actually. Wants us to go that way, I think. But, uh, or does it? Oh, what up? Thank you for uh, the likes on some of my art, Seek. I appreciate that. Hey, no problem. I'm glad I see them, because sometimes, like, when I'm on Instagram, um, you know, like my, f it's not like it used to be on Instagram. I think it kind of follows more of the Facebook formula, which I'm not a big fan of, but it'll just like randomly throw stuff up there. And I guess if you like a page or two or li uh, like an image or two, that person might start showing up more and more in your feed. And so, uh, so I think, you know, it's like, uh, I feel like I'm missing a lot of people's stuff, so it's like I gotta just gotta get better at going to people's actual pages. Um, so yeah, I promise to try to do that at some point. Uh oh, is this the fourth? Yes, magic orbs. Magic orbs can be enhanced by the souls of the demons. Their power may aid the one who bears them. All right. Let's uh let's go solve that puzzle then. Before we progress. Oh shoot. You know what? I think this guy there's a big guy in here too. Let's just take this herb. Oh, never mind. The big guy has moved on. He's right there. Thank god he's slow. Alright, so we have the file, magic orbs, it's like the thing with the triangle and the triangle. What's that second one? Pitch, upside down pitchfork. Boom. It was just two, that's where it kept getting me, was... I was thinking it was going to be three. Um, well, I'll save when we get to the other one. Uh, no worries. I have noticed Twitter doesn't show everything on the main page, and sometimes stuff on Instagram uh, gets buried under a lot of posts. Yeah, that's kind of what happens. Oh, shoot. Ooh, that was really close. Um, yeah, my roommate's out watching Punisher, uh, Punisher season two in the living room right now. So, uh, I'm like, oh good, I got like two hours. I could just, before he probably starts winding down to go to sleep to play this. Um, I know, I think we're past the halfway point of this game. Oh! Ow, you mother... And for those, you know, who are here, hello everyone, welcome. Um... I have not played this game since 2001, I think, or whenever it came out. So, uh, this is kind of our, like, a not really a blind playthrough, but I don't really know what I'm doing either. <laughs> I'm just kind of guessing. And I have very little memories of this game, but uh, so far it's really awesome. Um, how is your roomie doing? He's doing great. Thank you for asking. Uh, it doesn't have a keyhole, so you need to figure out the locking mechanism. Bet you there's a puzzle. Ooh. The Great Arrow. Oh, crap. Do I have, like, a not-so-great arrow? Uh, Master Tengu. Is there a non-tank control setting for the remaster? Uh, hello, Master Tengu. Yes, actually, 
it defaultly is not tank controls. Uh, so it took me a little getting used to. Um, can't use this in air. This spell evil can only be used with the right bow. Okay, so we got. So we need that thing. But is it? It's like typical res evil. Do we have to switch something for it? Division staff. Nope. Hmm. Maybe we just got to run back out here and fight something. Hmm. Maybe we gotta. We'll come back. I guess. Let's put the arrow here. I bet you will. I bet you will come back with something to set on there. We probably just don't have it yet. Um, but yeah, it's it's actually not tank control. So sometimes I get a little, like if you're holding this too long and the camera cuts, you got to kind of um, like redirect yourself a little bit. Oh, good, an herb. Sweet. Fluorite. Uh, but how are you, man? Welcome to the stream. Onimusha 3 was so fun because of that. Um, you know, I, I think I John, John Renault is that's the, the character they added, right? In Onimusha 3, that was their big selling point, was like, hey, we got the star of the professional. Um, I remember playing that, but I think only one time, and I don't know if I beat it or not. I honestly can't remember. Oh, one of these. Okay. Um... I was feel like I was getting close. Three moves, huh? Boom! Nailed it. Nice. Ah, there we go. So now we can go. Oh, what up? Bro, take that. All those bows and arrows in here, and we're we're just we had to solve the puzzle to get. <laughs> All right, fine, Kata. However you want to play this. Oh, see. So sometimes I'll, I'll screw up on the controls. Uh, yeah, I was disappointed, Shen. Uh, I found it out that they didn't use his English for the English dub, only the French. Yes, I remember that. You can do it, Seek, we believe in you. <laughs> um, yeah, I remember that. I remember that they did that. Um, boom. I'm glad they weigh the same. So now we have the great arrow. We can bring it to Samonosuke. What did I just do that for? Oh, we got the green key. Okay. I was like, how are we going to get Samonosuke? Oh, okay. We got the key that is to the... Oh, you mother... Oh, it still didn't... I hate that she doesn't, like, auto-aim to him. Or maybe she did, and it, it didn't matter. Do we got to... Do we got to throw the arrow through this window over here? No. I felt like that window was meant for more. I see potential in you, window. Oh, what up? Boom. Green key. Uh, not, not yet. So explore. Okay. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I, um, I vaguely remember these games. I, uh, I worked at an electronic boutique when this came out and I, I remember loving it. I think I beat it like maybe once or twice on each setting, difficulty setting. And then that was kind of it. Um, and then two came out and I think I played it and just beat it one time on like normal mode and then same with three, but I honestly don't know if I remember beating three. 
And then I heard they released a Tactics one, which I wish I would have played because I love Tactics-style games. Um, and they also released uh, Dawn of something, Dreams maybe, but I never played that one. So I am not, like, with Resident Evil, I, I feel comfortable saying that I know a lot about that series, like the lore and stuff, and I'm even doing, like, the history of Resident Evil videos right now on my YouTube channel, uh, gearing up for Resident Evil 2. I'm a little behind. I should have posted another one today, but I got caught up on a bunch of other things. So I think on Wednesday I'm going to post maybe two or three um, if I get them all done in time. So that way I'm caught back up. Uh, and I'm, I'm basically planning to release, like, maybe one or two a week between now and, like, mid-February. And it basically will, my videos will detail the, the origins of Umbrella from, like, 1962 up to 1998, the day before Resident Evil 2 takes place. So that way it kind of catches new people up on the lore, bef you know, um, when they're playing, like, the, the remake of 2. Holy crap, I do not remember this lady. The only version of 1 I played was... Uh, Gemma on, on uh, original Xbox. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I guess they did release this, um, right? An Xbox version. I had an Xbox original when it, when it first came out, but then I ended up uh, giving it, I think, to my little brother um, when I moved. I was like, oh, you can have it. Because uh, I only bought it for Silent Hill 2 Restless Dreams. And then once I played that, I was like, right, I'm done. <laughs> Um, Consume that human over there at once. Oh. So these things, it's funny that these are like the enemy she summons because, uh, oh. Because we, um, we fought these guys and we like went, we met that little caterpillar dude and we went down to hell or whatever. <laughs> um, and we fought like, you know, our way through like 20 stages. I can't remember. We, we were there for a while. I should have hit her. Die. Yeah, come get some. Get it. Oh. oh, she got me good on her. Oh, you son of a... Oh, she killed her own bug. She's catching back up. Ooh, wow, that was a lot of health. That's nice. Wow. We gotta learn how to block. Hello, where's Barry? What's up, dude? Uh, she's... Blocking that's not good. Um, blocking that would have been great, though. What's up, Barry? How's it going, man? Thanks for being here tonight. Ow. Welcome to Onomatopoeia. <laughs> Boom. Done. She only needs one more hit, man. All that time I wasted. Um... What's up? If you guys haven't checked out Where's Barry's channel, I highly recommend it. Uh, dude is awesome. I was actually just binging his stuff all day today and last night. Um, he had these. He's been playing like the older Resident Evil games, like two and three, and tonight Code Veronica. And I was just wa I was watching uh, some of them. Like I'd pick up snippets from here and there when I was at work, but they were like good, like four to six hour streams. 
and, uh, and he's he's like killing it. He's got like twenty five thousand plus subscribers now, just past twenty six thousand, and just like two nights um, or one night or something. It, it's just crazy. But the guy makes really fun content, uh, especially dedicated to Resident Evil. So um, if you haven't checked him out, please do. There, you feel free to put a link to your channel down below. I actually put one of these in here, um, but I noticed I screwed up the links. So let me. I'll have to fix this on my next one. But these are all people that have kind of donated or or you know. Um, uh, sponsored the show in some kind of way so uh, I want to give you guys shout outs and I'm going to add more names there are more people to add on there but uh, but I put Barry on there today uh, and then also Tyler Hell um, who you see the first one up there um, he actually is our first donor to this channel for 2019 uh, he donated an entire copy of God of War uh, the newest God of War game to me so I promised him that as soon as we were done with Resident Evil 2, I will play God of War. Because my plan this year was to only play, like stream two or three days a month and play Resident Evil games and just play a different game every month for the whole year. And that was my original plan, but when you get a, a donation like that, <laughs> you gotta kinda just do it. And same with this, this game, I you know, technically this was a $15 credit someone gave me and then I paid the $5 difference to buy Onimusha. Uh, so, um, so yeah, that's why I'm like already broke my Resident Evil only rule for the year, uh, but that was really cool, Tyler. So I had to put him first since he's our first one of 2019. Yuki. Master Tango, speaking of original Xbox, everybody's all the Dark Souls of this or that, but the ref refresh of Ninja Gaiden on Xbox was the original hard game, but with the fast-paced combat. You know, I never did play that. Oh, we're back in the tower. Wow. Did we get everything over there? Yeah, we did. Okay, good. Because luckily we went back and solved that puzzle. I'm glad we did that now. Wow, that was smart in, in hindsight, even though I didn't have the power of hindsight. Um, all right. Hmm. I actually don't know where to go. Well, that's not true. I kind of do know where to go. Um, I just don't remember how to get there. <laughs> ah, hey. hey, there's yeah. Afraid? I have information that may help. Oh, good, because I was. Hey, won't you go to the dark realm? There is no guarantee you will live. Hmm. If you do, great rewards await you. Uh, not okay. yet. See you soon. Let me go save <laughs> in case we die, and let me maybe buy some herbs or something. Uh, let's enhance. Can I not? I can't buy herbs, can I? I just have to find them. Because my fear is that we have four medicines, and if I go down to that portal... I will, um, granted we'll get something great if we actually make it all the way through and survive, but I don't know if we will survive. Um, I have no idea if we'll survive, and and I'm worried that we're going to use all of our, our thingamabobs, <laughs> our, our, our herbs, and then come back and it's like, alright, we got to fight the boss of the game with like no herbs or no medicine. Hey, Ty holy crap, Tyler's in here! Hope you enjoy it, man. I think I will. I think I will, because it's God of War and it looks amazing. Um, I never did play that Ninja Guided game, though. Um, but I'll take your word for it, that that was like the original Dark Souls as far as difficulty <laughs> goes. Um, but uh, yeah, man, Tyler, thank you for that game. It was insanely nice. Like, I, I, I didn't know. I was like, hey, am I allowed to thank you? Like, is that cool? He's like, yeah, dude, totally. Um, so yeah, big shout out to Tyler. So he's our first donor to this channel for 2019. Um, oh, you mother... Oh, we can't go that way now. Okay, so there goes my idea of that. It... Oh, what? Another one? And another one, DJ Khaled. And another one. There it is. Uh, we need to right, equip the burst bullets, equip the fire arrows. Um, 
great armor. Yeah. Where'd all my... Oh, whatever. I was gonna say, I think, I was like, I'm pretty sure this is where we gotta use the bow and arrow. Um, hello, Lonely Tyler says. Yeah, so my Moobox back, so it'll tell you, you know, how to, if you ever wanna donate to the channel, any t anyone who donates, whether it's a dollar or five dollars, uh, hopefully you don't de donate more than five dollars. I think I'm gonna come up with a rule on here. If you donate more than five dollars, anything over five, I'm gonna donate to the Brain Aneurysm Foundation, um, unless you specifically want like your ten dollars to go towards like a game or something. Um, but I'll let you be the judge of that. But if you don't care, I'll probably do that because really, um, I kind of am okay with not making like any real money at streaming or anything. You know, I've been on YouTube for like five years and Twitch for like three years and I've done well and I've been able to buy a couple games here and there thanks to you guys. Um, and uh, and like, you know, money for that new the computer I got. Uh, so uh, so for me, it's like I've done everything I've wanted to do for the most part. So from here on out, it's like uh, I just I'll take five bucks. We'll put it towards like an upcoming game or something. But otherwise, um, we'll just donate it to people who need it. So those links can always be found. And you can always type in Why command brains with your worthless little toy? like this. I have no and time then boom. Brain Aneurysm Foundation say? and the Joe Necro Foundation both dedicated to helping people who have had it way worse than I do. So uh, you can always give there too and I'll put you on the list of parasites. Marcellus? Whoa. Oh, it's just a gold one of those other knights. Um, I say that, but of course now he's probably gonna like beat my brains in. Oh, I have a. Why do I have the bow and arrow equipped? Yeah, man. Ooh. Oh, I was going to say, is he going to, he might hit me. Oh, what's up? What's over there? Medicine. Hey, thanks, game. Wow, he's, he's fast. Ah, dang. I hit, I hit block too right at that last second. Whoa. Get up. Okay. Thank you. Good. Thank you. Ooh. Why did I... <laughs> so if you missed my comment before, um, if you, uh... If you press the the joystick too too hard, whoa! Oh, good. At least his shield's gone. Uh, if you press the joystick that makes you move too hard, it'll bring the map up. <laughs> I think that's a pretty crappy place for the map button to be, but um, but yeah. So sometimes you'll see me bring the map up in the middle of the fight. Not giving up any uh, orbs. It's all right. Just gonna. I just like at this point, let him get a shot or two in. Just go full force. Um. But I, I really dig this game. I mean, I, I miss fixed camera angles in video games, and so 
when I saw this was really re-released, I was like, I'm so excited. Actually, you'll even see here on Twitch and on my YouTube channel, I did a trailer reaction to, uh, which I, I don't do a lot of those <laughs> for, for obvious reasons. Um, I think they're not very difficult to make as far as content goes. Uh, so I, I try not to get into a habit of doing too many, but every once in a while I'll see like a trailer for something that I'm like, or see that it came out and I'm like, Ooh, I want to, I want to check that out. Um, you know, I want to, I want to check out that trailer and I want to record it. Um, all right. Can't use that. This is made from a different metal. Is there something behind it? Yeah, probably. Jerk. Hmm. I figured maybe one of the specials had to open it because there's a, a refuel tank here. But nope. It doesn't look like it. Dang. You know what? We already used that. Let's switch to the fire sword. I'm excited for the new Mortal Kombat. Oh, yeah. Actually, that looks kind of cool. Um, I've always been a Mortal Kombat fan. But, um, but uh, yeah, I'm curious about that one. Really curious. Do you think maybe the gun? No. <laughs> No, oh, well, I tried. Mm. Did nothing. Okay, back to bed. Kitty, hey, have a good night. Give our best to Elijah. Everybody send Kitty some love. What's this? The Demon World map? What? Alright, let's, uh, let's save. into slot 5 because we might go back to 4 after we beat this and try to do the rest of the demon world um, but that way we don't have to like worry about that get some rest kitty absolutely oh what up dang it alright more like Running down this like the spine of this tower, so cool. I I like this uh, the design of this game. I know it's like clearly like 16, 17 years old. Whoa, what? There's like a yeah. Our weapons are so strong now um, that uh, they can kill most of these guys in like one or two hits. Ugh. Just sit here and level up the whole time if we wanted. Ugh, you can hear it too. Hello, eight people. Welcome to the stream. Hopefully, you're enjoying the show. My name is Seek and Destroy, and uh, so far, I'm living up to my name. I'm actually killing things. <laughs> oh, now you know what? I spoke too soon. Come on, bro. Look at that. Nice. Got him. Two medicines. All right. That means we are going to fight something big. How we leaving what we drink in? Jamily. Oh, she wins the game tonight. I have water, which I haven't opened yet. Um, and I'm because I'm trying to finish this Pepsi that I've been nursing for like an hour while uh, editing and uploading videos to my gaming channel. Whoa! Oh, here's the Demon King. He he has the body of a snake. Wow. Don't let him get her. Of course, you know, makers of Resident Evil, it's gotta have, gotta be a snake, right? <laughs> I'm actually king things. Nope, I spoke too soon. See, 2019. <laughs>
Whoa. Are we at the end of the game? That's Nobunaga. Holy crap, we might be at the end of the game. Demon Snake! Demon Snake! No, Princess Yuki! No, little boy who hated us! That's a hero. Now you're a man, a manny man, man. A medicine. See? <laughs> Never fails. Give me that. What is that? Oh, shoot. No! No, please don't be a one hit kill. I need uh, medicine and okay, a soul absorber. So anything he spits out, I will automatically get. I think. Oh, not that it matters. We kicked his butt. <laughs> Long boy snip. Well, he wasn't much. But I don't think he's the final boss. Kaede, let's get out of here. Oh, maybe maybe he is the final boss? I'm fine. We cannot stay here any longer. Run! Maybe we would maybe we should have went through hell <laughs> just to see what other like a trinket was down there for us. Because we got that like little horn thing and we never even used it. I'm thinking we need another half of some. I don't know. Oh, he ain't dead. Pink Lightning, the most evil of electricity. <laughs> I'm a demon from hell. Check out my lightning! <laughs> it's like, huh, unexpected. But challenge accepted. Oh! And, yeah, you know what? That's what I get. That's what I get. Ooh! Just like in Star Wars. What the hell? Look at our tits, bro. <laughs> good God. <laughs> well, maybe not good God. Stop punching. <laughs> wow. Dang, did we become a demon? 
That gauntlet, like, gave us demon powers. Who made the gauntlet? Heaven? Like, why would a demon gauntlet give us powers against the guy who creates demons? I don't know. It's like the Ghost Rider story. I always confused. I'm like, the devil's gonna give someone power that they can use to beat him? Look at this. Nobunaga. What's up, bro? You wanna fight? I just killed a giant snake. You're a dude. Um, what? Dang, we bisected his hand. Yeah, I know, right? were shattered by the hand of Samanosuke and his friends. However, when Yoshitatsu Saito died the following year, his feeble-minded son, Tatsuoki, became the Lord. Mm. At that time, Oda's army returned to Mino province and conquered the Inabayama castle, putting an end to the history of the Saito family. However, it is unknown as to whether demons were involved. After the downfall of the Saito family, Princess Yuki went to stay with a family friend, the Baron in Sakai province. His name? Sokyu Imai. However, in less than a month, she would leave. With Sokyu's blessing, she left in a ship to see the world. Hmm. On Samanosuke's advice, Yumemaru accompanied her on this journey. On the other hand, Kaede desperately searched for the missing Samanosuke. But never found Because that's what the princess always wanted, right? She wanted she always dreamed of Mitsuhide Akechi employed her as his agent. She always wanted to see the world with Samanosuke, but I guess since he died in a war at Yamazaki province. Um Oh, she died 14 years later. Well, this is the ending. As for Samanosuke, Holy crap. No one knows what happened to him. Holy cat. What's up, P. Jones? P.J. Jones. <laughs> What's up, man? Welcome. Um, you know, I was honestly hoping to play this for like two hours tonight. And, of course, we freaking beat it in 50 minutes. Um, wow. You know, I never remember. I didn't remember this game being this short, to be honest with you guys. Uh, I always remembered it taking me a long time to beat it. Um, but then again, my memory's for shit, so it makes sense that uh, I would be wrong. Oh, what up? What's up, danger? Oh, he's still alive. Presented by Capcom. Thanks, Moobot. There you go, my YouTube channel's right there. Playtime. Four hours and 40 minutes. Oh, what? We missed three fluorites? We absorbed a lot of effing souls, though. We got to the 20th floor of the Dark Realm. Um, and we got an A ranking. And we get a special outfit. Because Capcom loves to play dress-up. We'll save it in slot six. Oh, or maybe it just saved it wherever it wanted to. Um, okay. Well, what the F? Well, you know what we got to do then? I mean, it seems only right that uh, I end this stream, give me about a 10-minute break, and we come back on at 11, which is in about 10 to 12 minutes, and we play the first hour of God of War, uh, which was donated to us by Tyler. Um, that makes the most sense to me, because I wasn't expecting to beat this tonight. Uh, or if so, I thought it was going to take two hours to beat. So, um, so yeah, since I still have an hour left, what do you got? You guys feel like doing that? I'll just give me like a five, ten minute break, and I'll come back on here with God of War. Um, I think it's downloaded, so I don't have to wait, you know, have, you know, wait for it or anything. Um, but I do want to check on Echo, see if he needs a walk and, you know, all that stuff. But, uh, if you guys are down ten minutes away, if you want to hang out in the chat, you can. Uh, we'll come back in here in ten minutes for, uh, for God of War. Let me see some votes in the chat if you guys are cool with that or not. Um, but PJ Jones, thanks for being here, man. Good to see you again. Uh, Lonely, everybody popped in. Tyler, who popped in. Uh, Master Tengu, uh, who was, I think, new here for popping in. Thank you very much. Uh, Tyler's down for sure, he says. <laughs> uh, and uh, and Lonely's down for sh for uh, as well. Um, so it looks like we're getting, getting some votes. I know I figured Tyler would be 
Um, I have never played a God of War game. I've played, I've played none of them, but I've watched. I think a friend of mine named Todd uh, play the third one a little bit, uh, but I never played it myself. Um, so this will be a new experience for me. So if there's references and lore to the first games, I will not catch them. <laughs> so I'll rely on you guys to kind of educate me if I'm confused with stuff. Uh, all I remember about the first one is that they were kind of like more Greek god based. You know, it's like Ares and all that stuff. And from what I've seen in this one, it looks like a lot different. It looks like, uh, you know, more like Norse mythology. Um but that's the extent of my knowledge, because uh, I've only seen like two trailers. I have seen zero gameplay of God of War 2, um, but I have seen that it's won a ton of uh, awards and it's done really well in sales. And that makes me very happy because it looked like a lot of cool people worked on it, including uh, some people we know here. So thank you, thank you. Um, so if you guys want to hang out, uh, got a crash drama, he says long drive tomorrow, but I can't wait to watch on stream. Okay, well, I'll, I will try these videos, the Onimusha ones, and the God of War one we played tonight, um, I will try to get those up, like, next weekend, um, or maybe right around the time Resident Evil's, you know, coming out on Friday, because um, right now I'm still uploading old streams, and I think I need about another day or two to get through all those and, and re-upload all those. So once those are all uploaded, you'll see this, you'll see our South Park stream, uh, which we still got to beat that. Uh, we got to beat the last two DLCs of Spider-Man. Uh, and then we'll have God of War to play. But all these things we'll, you know, we'll play little bits of here and there. Uh, then we'll focus on Resident Evil 2, and then we'll come back after Resident Evil 2 with more God of War. Uh, but for Onimusha, this is going to be it for now. I'm sure we'll play it again somewhere down the road, uh, but probably not anytime soon. It was nice to play it this time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And for everyone who's here, thanks for being here live. Hang out. Stay safe, Jamalee, on your drive work tomorrow. Everyone else, thank you for being here. Don't go anywhere if you're live. We'll come back in about 10 minutes with God of War. And if you're watching later on YouTube, we will see you in the future. Peace.